wand maker is nice to have on turn two. Hopefully my opponent's not aggro shadow priest. Not even Shadow Priest. Maybe a Big Priest? I actually have all three spell schools for my multicaster already. Well, my turn three sucked. Uh, well. Totem. Opponent, please play a minion so I can play something. Well, they've all been assembled. Absolutely fascinating gameplay. What? You did nothing with an overdraw coming? Oh my god, my opponent. I hope you're proud of this 8 drop. Yes, yes, very impressive. Oh, a 10 10. Well, it's actually a really good devolving missiles for me. Because it's going to end up being, what, a 1 drop? I'm kind of tempted to perpetual flame it. Is that unreasonable? I don't think so. Maw of Cthune is definitely a good pickup. Probably a pretty good chance of another Idol of Yasharaj coming down this turn, considering how bad my opponent's early game has been. The path is clear for the um... I'll just throw out the Thalnos here, I guess. What an odd combination of cards to have in your deck. Um, I guess Perpetual Flame is good here. How many cards do I have in hand? Eight. I'll trade this off so I can play a Primal Dungeoneer in its place. Did they draw the Zyrella? I honestly don't mind this. Nine cards in hands. If I want to play Multicaster, I do need to play something first. 
Oh, I only have six mana this turn. That's going to be hard to do. Um, I guess I'll just play the Canal Slogger this turn. Interesting. Well, this isn't a great Bolner, but it's kind of hard to imagine how I could really use it. Kind of a bummer, but not really unexpected. Uh, they do have a random one drop in the res pool. I don't remember what it was, though. Well, I kind of want to play Mutanus here, but if I eat some random garbage minion that I devolved their board into, I'm going to be sad. I mean, if it was the one drop, they probably just would have played it, right? And sometimes I just hit a different minion altogether. Yet another light shower elemental. Now let her well, Talon draws Canal Slogger. It's not super good, but I'm getting deep enough in the deck that I just want to draw all my cards. I have so much in store for you. Another Void Flare. I do have a Devolving Missiles for it, potentially. I guess maybe I just want to kill it with Canal Slogger, though. But man, Devolving Missiles basically just single-handedly kills it. I don't know. Eye of Cthune is also an option. Three damage with these, and then I have eight missiles to deal four damage. It's actually not super good odds. Kill it with Heart of Cthune, I guess. Seems like Heart of Cthune's pretty bad in the matchup. They have three raised edded minions and a dragon. That is a hell of a dragon. I would love to play both of these Cthune pieces here, but this thing really needs to die. Maybe a good Instructor Fireheart. Just kind of a weird turn overall. I'll go Instructor Fireheart, I guess. Guidance is always nice. Uh, having another Lightning Storm can't hurt. Oh, actually, I don't even have anything to draw with Investment Opportunity, so I shouldn't have taken that. Seems like I'm not killing that this turn. And I might even overdraw my Macaw. I guess I should have hit with the weapon before playing uh, Molten Blast and I would have killed it. 
pretty sloppy turn for me in a lot of ways. All right, that's fine, I guess. All right, pretty low on life, but I do have this canal slogger. This is a nine cost card. I kind of want to revolve to get rid of this five health minion. This can't go too wrong, can it? It can go pretty wrong. But can it go that wrong? Excellent outcome. Maybe my opponent's not playing a scary minion this turn. That would be great for me. The sun exposes That's pretty scary, but Devolving Missiles is really good against it. Alright, Cthoon in the deck. If I do whiff on the Cthune next turn, I can play Primal Dungeoneer, which draws the only other card in my deck, and I will be guaranteed to have Cthune the following turn. Well, there it is. I think I just let it rip. Hopefully my opponent doesn't somehow have lethal with plus two spell damage. And the second Cthune takes it. Love to see Custodian in the opener. Well, that's pretty annoying. Alt Neophyte. Should be easy enough to kill that with an AoE. How can I help you?
I'm definitely up against some whack shit. I guess I'll just kill those. They're both pretty annoying. Where's the devolving missiles when you need it? Well, I have played Perpetual Flame already for the multicaster, so uh, after I play this Lightning Storm, it does draw two, which is nice. What does Investment Opportunity even draw on my deck? Perpetual Flame, Lightning Storm, Canal Slogger? I think that's it. That was so bad. Well, let's go ahead and draw two cards here. Another investment opportunity. Um, I only have three overload cards left in my deck, so I do want to get around to playing those soon. Maybe just both of them with Canal Slogger next turn. Another Slogger. Um, they do have Jewel of Nazoth for next turn, right? So they have Teacher's Pet and Rodent Nest. Is that it? They played a carry in studies at some point, but I don't remember what they got off of it. Well, I guess I can do this and heal up the six. Might just be playing this parrot as a multicaster at some point. Oh, it was the enthusiastic banker, of course. Wow, they play strongman? It's actually pretty interesting. Well, Lightning Storm Eye of Cthune should be really good here. That's obnoxious. This is eight missiles. I'm debating on making this attack first. Probably somewhat likely to hit that twice. This is a pretty bad outcome. But not terrible. My opponent's showing 13 damage. So probably can't really play Mutanus here. Maybe this Macaw is useful. Maw of Cthune for the 4-6 is fine, I guess. Still taking a bit of damage, but I've got some lifesteal. Did not want to see that. It's not a super good jewel, though. My final Cthune piece. Interesting. I can just play that plus Talon here. Is that unreasonable? Give my opponent a bunch of 1-1s. One Probably just die if I do that, honestly. Never be afraid. 
I'll just see what Instructor Fireheart can do here. X is good. Shane Lightning does four, right? Beautiful. Tidal Wave seems like it has a lot of potential to be really good. What an annoying watch post. Pretty sure I'm just playing Slogger here. Nature waits for no one but me. Now let her end. <laughs> Might play Devolving Missiles with Tidal Wave next turn. Okay, no cleave, that's nice. Oh, they've played both Light Crushers already. Kind of interesting to play Rust Rot Viper with that card. Wait, and they play Pack Mule with Guardian Animals, I just realized. Seems like some shoddy construction on that deck over there. Oh. They just popped that for me. That's fine. Not sure how to feel about that. I should have plenty of breathing room to just go Heart of Cthune Tail in here, though. And that should be a winning position for me. This does say up to 10, right? Okay. My opponent's got three minions, but they only deal four damage. That's kind of scary at this much mana, but I don't really know what it could do that would be disastrous. Oh. Oh, they got a demon? God, Devolving Missiles is such a bad card. They do actually prevent me from playing Cthune here, though. Let's go ahead and see what we can eat. Sure. Alright, easy Cthune turn. Let's see if the opponent has any response to this. I've seen both jewels and both guardian animals already, so... May not even need the Macaw. Although my opponent still has so much health. So sick. Oh, 
Unfortunately, I think they die before it triggers the second time. Oh, I was wrong. It just doesn't have a target. Did it just shoot my Mutanus? What the heck? 